everyone, I hope you're well. So for today's video, I'm going to eat pancakes for the whole day. Now, I absolutely love pancakes. And when I came up with this video idea, I was like, I like the sound of this, but I want to see by the end of the day, would I be fed up with pancakes? Do you know like when people ask you, oh, if you could only eat one thing for the rest of your life, what would it be? Pancakes could be an option for me. So let's see if I can last a day eating them, let alone a whole lifetime. Let's get straight into this video and I'm going to make my pancakes for breakfast and I think I'm going to have bacon on mine today. I had this recently in a video and it was so good. So yeah, I've just wrote down all the ingredients. I'm going to make a big batch and then, you know, save time throughout the day. So let's get making the pancakes. <laughs> normally I don't know why I've done it exactly the same should be okay because yeah it's not too bad so I've got my pen ready I'm gonna put some in and make the first batch of pancakes <laughs> shambles i'm hoping it's just you know the first one goes bad and then the rest go okay i think it's because it's too runny oh i'm not happy with this it doesn't look like a pancake so i have to put the second one on the pan hopefully this will look better i added a bit more flour to the mixture so it was a bit thicker Yay! it actually stayed up together let me show you oh beautiful <laughs> So whilst the last pancake is cooking, which looks absolutely banging by the way, I've added a little bit of bacon um, to the side, so hopefully it'll all be done at the same time. That bacon, I mean that, that pancake looks good. So here are the pancakes, we've got three stacks and then I'm going to sprinkle, I'm going to put some of this on it, it's the closest thing I have to like a uh, maple syrup type of thing. Hopefully it's nice. <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. and there we go they are the pancakes first pancakes of the day can't wait so i finished my pancakes for breakfast they were so so good but i'm really full now so I'll be back later for lunch and I think I know what I'm going to have for lunch but we'll keep that surprise until later. Now lunchtime and I'm going to make the next set of pancakes. I'm going to go for sweet pancakes this time and I'm going to do chocolate chips with whipped cream. So these two chocolate chips I'm using, they are so good. The from our day they're just dark chocolate chips. <laughs> they are incredible. So this is what's going to go on. I've got the batter here, the pan is just heating up behind me. And I'm really excited for this. Yeah, the batter seems a lot more thick, by the way. So hopefully these will turn out a lot better than before. Just painted my nails. Um, and I feel like they're all going to sponge now. Because I never have the patience to wait in ages for your nails to dry. Like, I've waited at least, like, 15 minutes. <laughs> um, and I've already smudged them a bit. But I'm not surprised. So let's try it. Mm, so nice. So I put some batter out and I put some chocolate chips on top and hopefully when I flip it over it works. Um yeah, I'm excited for this because I've never made chocolate chip pancakes before. So hopefully it goes well. So I've just flipped it over and that side looks really good, but I'm scared to see what the other side ends up like. And now we've got chocolate chips in. But so far so good. I did burn my tongue because I, I had this chocolate that burnt the tongue. So I've just flipped it and I know what the other side looks like and it was not what I was planning for it to look like basically. Um, I'll show you in a minute because 
you probably laugh at me <laughs> but um yeah i'm just waiting for it to fully cook through what i think i'm gonna do is have this one and then see how i feel afterwards if i still want another chocolate one or if to have one with like jam instead and have a more sweet but like a more fruity sweet instead of a chocolatey sweet so that's the plan okay let's let me flip it and show you what this oh god let me show you way i think that's done yeah so let's add some squirty cream There we are. I, don't, I don't know what I'll do with that, but there we are. <laughs> and here's my second pancake of the day. I'll let you know how it is. So I just finished my pancake and it was really nice, but I could not have another chocolate one because I was really chocolatey and if I have any more, I'll... I feel very sick. So I might wait a little bit and then have a jam one. I think I have some frozen fruit as well, so maybe put some of that on top. That could be really nice. But yeah, it was a good pancake. So I'm in the mood for a little snack and also I can only eat pancakes. So let's have a little pancake snack. Um, the, I'm gonna have jam because I'm still in the mood for something sweet and I don't want my dinner yet because that's not going to be sweet. So let's just have a small pancake with a bit of jam to keep me going until dinner. For this pancake, I'm just going to have some strawberry jam. I actually really love this jam. It's um, from Aldi. I always get this one. And it's just so nice. <laughs> Don't you think that just looks so cute? See, it's a bit smaller, this one. And it's almost there, ready to eat. But it looks cute. It looks very really smooth. <laughs> Here is my next pancake. Just put a bit of jam on it. I feel like this is going to be nice. dinner time and i've just got my first pancake cooking so what i'm going to put on the pancakes tonight is this and it's a heinz creation spanish beans with smoky pepper and onion this is what it is and i've never tried this before so i don't fully know what to expect i just expect like nice beans i guess like you're guessing just a bit fancier than like the normal tin beans i'm not sure if to put a bit of uh, bacon in it to like you know add something else because this says like oh it's nice to put with something i'm excited to try it though because it does sound really nice it's just pinto and haricot beans with smoky tomato pepper and onion sauce that sounds up my street so yeah i'm excited to try this so i have just woken up from a nap and i don't know if that's to do with you know my diet that i'm eating today just eating pancakes or it's just me and i love a nap that sofa seriously the sofa at my house in uni so what about it? I can just have a nap so easily on it if I just lie down. So I'm not really going to say it's a, the diet and I'm just going to say it's me and I'm lazy and um, yeah. <laughs> but I thought, you know, it would be interesting to add just in case. And I've been drinking a lot of water today and I don't normally drink water and I was like, oh, I need water. It's making a lot of noise back there. Um, Today I've just been like drinking a lot of water and I don't normally, I'd normally be like, oh I'll have lemonade or I'll have juice and that, but I've been like, no I want water so. It'll be interesting to see if that's linked to the pancakes. Here's a look at the final thing. These beans are really nice, I just tried a little bit and they are nice. That pancake on top is a beastie boy as well. So yeah, I'm going to try this and hopefully it's nice. Hopefully. <laughs> pancakes and they were actually really nice i wasn't sure if it was going to taste good or not but i actually like enjoyed it probably won't have it again but it was nice so yeah that is my last meal of the day 
I'm gonna say I'm not fed up with pancakes. I could definitely eat enough one right now. It'd be interesting if I could go a week with pancakes. I don't know if I could do that. I feel like a day was good, nice treat, a week. I feel like I need a proper meal. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know if you think you could last a week of just eating pancakes. And I'll see you all very soon. Goodbye.